This is second generation anodized aluminum. First generation started with chiasma. We went on to crossover. crossover. Yeah. And then big A cross. Big A cross, of course. Yep. Caster five. Caster five. All right, next one. Zaphire. Zaphire. And the beast. The beast. Adelphia the beast. Adelphia the beast. 111 moves to solve it. Hardest burr puzzle in production in the world right now. The hardest. Commercially available puzzle. Good luck. Burr. Burr puzzle. It's hard. It's real hard. Check it out. Puzzle guy, you picked the wrong hat. Uh, he picked the right hat. It's all about the snapbacks. Get your votes in or giving away some hats. Yeah, vote, I think it's episode 42? Two episodes ago. Two episodes ago, yeah, 42. We are giving away these hats. You gotta yeah. vote in the comment section for your favorite mesh, mesh back, back snapback. or the like regular snapback. So far, I'm up three to two on you, thanks we'll to Puzzle we'll Guy. Yeah, pick the wrong hat. Yeah, so we're gonna give away one of each. Um, we're gonna pick a name out of the people who vote for the mesh back. We're gonna pick a name out of the people who vote for the regular snap back. So get your vote in on episode 42 of Puzzle Time 42. Puzzle yeah. Time. Episode 41 got to 100 likes as of about half an hour ago. Yeah, yeah, literally. I, we were coming and we we're getting ready to shoot this. I was looking, it was at 99 likes. I was like, oh, we're not gonna make it for this episode, but. We did. Got one more like. One more. So thank you to whoever did our hundredth like. Um, we've got a special episode coming we up. Do, we do. That's all that means. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna get it together. We're gonna go egg Tony's house and it'll be cool. It's gonna be awesome. Tony's coming to come at me with a razor. I don't even know what it's gonna look like. Apparently Tony's <laughs> cut sixteen people's hair. Or I'll COVID be the cuts, 16. man. COVID yeah. cuts. We practicing. So, he's practiced. So yeah, if you want to see me get my hair cut, I don't know what it's gonna be. We're gonna work that out. It's gonna be in the next month here. We'll probably do it. Nah, um, we'll figure it out on the weekend. Maybe <laughs> maybe next week. So we'll see. Keep it out, keep an eye out for that. We will be egging houses and cutting hair. So all right. Thank you. Special episode today. We do. Yeah. Uh, well, we got a bunch of metal puzzles in. Yeah. So puzzle puzzle master has a brand new line of stuff, which mm -hmm. began with um, uh, chiasma. the chiasma. So now you guys have seen this. Some of you have ordered it. Yeah, we did an episode on this one early on. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So yeah, and this, so the thing I like is this is the color scheme we're going with, hey? Like that There's four, different so, no, but, but the brown, gold, silver, and black. Yeah. This whole line is going to have like those colors mm -hmm. in it, which is cool. Okay, cool. So, yeah, Chiasma, the original one. So we'll we put talked that, about that before. Put that off to the side here. All right. Which one do you want to go into next? I don't know. I'll, I'll lose the names of all. So these. we've got one, two, three, four, five, five new puzzles so we got a little cheat sheet here because we got some like info on them so if we're, if we're looking off screen here it's because we're just uh getting into the cheat sheet uh, okay well let's go with the uh this one we'll go with the first one on the list adelphia, adelphia. the hardest one the hardest one. we are starting with the hardest one adelphia put it not on a black background yeah okay so actually you know before we get into that let's do this okay these puzzles are going to come in bags um, for the whole line. So even Chiasma now is gonna come in a bag. Um, so we've got these really cool like fabric, I don't know, felt bags, hey, grab one. They got the Puzzle Master logo. I was told that if you didn't get a bag with your Chiasma, so some of the people who have ordered already with their Chiasma didn't get a bag, let us know, email us, um, info at puzzlemaster.ca and uh, we'll send you a bag for free. So free. that is what I was told to tell you. If you want a bag for your Chiasma, let us know. Maybe even if you order some of these other puzzles, we can send the bag with it. So cool. Yeah, cool. Nice. 
Yeah. And uh, when it does come in this bag, it's all unassembled. Yes, for this Adelphia. I think so. Oh, the other, the, the other, one. this is the only one okay. because this puzzle is just rank hard. So it'll come out like this. It's, it's a two, four, six, eight piece puzzle. Um, and these are all a hundred percent made in Canada. Um, we're supposed to give a special shout out to Aaron Williams, who does our solutions. He was integral in the creation of these. So like, yeah, he does metal work and nice. the, yeah, this is all his expertise and abilities so um yeah we just need yeah. to say thank you to him and for the guys who designed yeah, these the manufacturing and then there was a couple designers from uh, one guy from france france yes yeah, steph or i'm just sure how to say his name yeah we're gonna butcher we're probably it. gonna butcher it i'm sorry stephane cholmian i said stephan colmine that's Comine. what i was going with hard to say yeah but yeah stephane cholmine yeah and so. then there's only one other designer eh yeah, so okay, Stefan designed this and he designed Crossover, which is this one right here. So this is Crossover there, and he designed this one. Both level 10s, um, but this one, this Adelphia is, okay, it's called Adelphia the Beast. So I think it's mm. actually a pretty cool name. Um, yeah, so eight pieces, it's 111 moves to solve. 111 moves. There is some, so we're gonna get into some of these burr puzzles as we make more. Like there's a whole bunch that we've got like coming after this stuff even. Mm -hmm. But some of these get crazy hard. Yeah. Um, all of these came in in pieces. I watched the puzzle master put these <laughs> together at his desk for two and a half weeks. Yeah, Alan was working for a long time on these. So what he was going off of is this tool that you can get off of puzzlemaster.ca. It's a 3D rendering of a burr puzzle and you just use forward and back arrows for the program to take each piece and move each piece and it'll walk you through all 111 pieces. 100, this, or 111 moves. This took him over three hours to do right here, this one. So hence why that is coming like this when you get it. And you have to put it together as the, uh, yeah. And so these are, moves are broken down into um, decimals, right? We've done this before. So it's, it's how it's, it's, the decimals is the amount of moves it takes to take one piece off, kind of. And we'll get each... one move into the right spot. Yeah. One piece into the right spot. Yeah. yeah. So the first, on this one, it's 94 moves to get the first piece out. Then three moves to get the next one out. Then two, three, 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 three for a total of 111 moves. 94 to start. I, oh, and this, so all of these puzzles have one solution except for, is it this one? Is it crossover? Right into it, man. Yeah, this is crossover. Cool. So crossover has two solutions. So uh, yeah, two possible solutions. At least Alan found that when he did it, apparently. Mm. So you play with that, I'm gonna play with this a little bit. I just wanna see like the movements, hey? Like, I don't even wanna do this, man. No? No, no, I really don't. I watched him do this for so long. Yeah, so he's doing the same puzzle over and over. So these are not only made by Puzzle Master, but they are put together by the Puzzle Master, pretty much because he's the only one who can do it here at the office. Yeah. I guess Aaron could do it, but. Yeah. Yeah, so. So funny. <laughs> cool. Okay, so Adelphia the Beast, which is that one? That's Crossover. So two those, are, those are the two Stefan Chomin puzzles. Um, one other thing I should mention, this one will come in like the four colors. So like what use the four colors here, you'll have an option on the beast uh, to buy it in one of these four colors. Mm -hmm. Or if you really want to get creative, buy all four and then mix them up however you like. But it will not come in a mixed color palette from what I hear right now. It'll be like solid colors like this. Mm -hmm. So that's just something. Add to the there. degree of difficulty. Yeah. Okay. So we have beast. Crossover, crossover, big A cross. Is that that one? Yeah, that's this one. All right. Yeah, I think this looks like a like a butterfly or. or I think this was the coolest one actually. Yeah, I think it looks like a maybe a Tie Fighter a from, whole, uh, from Star Wars. Star Wars. Yeah, Star Wars. But okay, so what were you saying about this? Just looks like a corner, man. The whole puzzle's done in the corner. Yeah, I think it's. I, I think looks wise, this one looks really cool. Yeah. Um. So this one is called Big A Cross. Big A Cross, 46 moves. It is designed, so this one and the next two that we'll do after this are designed by Yavuz Demirhan. Wow, that was good, well done. Yavuz, yeah. I've, uh, I've Turkey, he's from Turkey. Turkish, mm-hmm. So this is 
a level nine. It is 46 moves expressed by the following decimals, 31.7.8. So 31 pieces, moves to get the first piece off, seven moves to get the second piece off, and then third move, thir or eight moves to get the last two pieces apart. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Out of all of them, that's the one I thought I liked the best. Yeah, I think it's Which neat. Is, uh, and I, I actually, I wonder, I'm not 100% sure, but I wonder if these are going to come in like the different, you know how Chiasma came in like the different mm -hmm. uh, configurations with the colors? I don't know if this one will. We'll see. So, yeah. Big A cross. Let's move on to, let's do this one. Let's do Caster 5. Caster five. Here, you hold this one. This, this is the weird one. This is the easiest one of them all. Okay. So it's only a level eight. So I feel like this one's attainable. You should try it. You, let's, let's see you do this one. I want to see if you can get it. I don't, actually haven't seen any of these. You play with it. I'll talk about it. And this was actually uh, Alan, the puzzle master. This was his stated favorite puzzle of the collection. Okay. So he yeah. liked this one. So he said this is his favorite because it, he said it's a good entry level bird puzzle. So if you want to get into bird puzzles, maybe you're like a, like into Hanayama stuff only, or you've just kind of seen some of the, maybe like the, the wood stuff. This would be a good like entry level burr puzzle if you're one to kind of like get into it. Level eight, 25 moves, 15, three, five to solve it. Uh, any, any luck? I wonder if there's rotation. Well, I can start to, I was wondering that too, because these. Yeah, I bet you there's rotation in this one. Yeah, gotta yeah. be. Well, because they, they're three blocks wide, but you can't get into the pla the back one. Like it's constantly blocked no matter like, because this one's facing the other way, hey? Oh. Yeah, so you could just get stuck. Hmm. I don't know. Cool. Yeah, that is, what is that one, Ken? Where, caster a, 5? A, caster 5. Caster 5. Cool. Yeah. I got it back at the beginning. Designed by Yavuz Demirhan. Caster 5, we'll put it right there. Okay, and last but not least, Zapphire. Why don't you talk about this one? Okay, Zapphire, all right. I'll play with 33 that. moves to solve. 17, 7, 4, 2, 3. Uh, same Ooh. designer. Ooh, that was a good move. Oh, dude. <laughs> I'm solving it. Yeah, you got it. And this is kind of the cool part about a bird puzzle. Oh, oh, oh big oh, rotation. Maybe, maybe, maybe it doesn't. Keep going. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice. Okay, I'm getting too far in this. Back pedal, oh, back pedal. Yeah, back pedal. I, I just. I don't want to throw another like puzzle on the the fire there for, for Al. <laughs> is this one coming in a bunch of different colors too? Or is it uh, be... I'm not 100% sure on these ones. We'll figure that out, I guess, when you order them. It'll, it'll be clear on the website. But this one was interesting because Alan said this was the one that gave him the most trouble in doing the solutions mm -hmm. um, because it has a lot of tiny moves, apparently. Okay. So lots of little moves. So some of the other, I don't know, I even know what that means, but that was what he said. Lots of little moves and it was hard to do. So, or difficult to put together, even with the solution in front of him. So, yeah. Okay, having the solution in front of you, does, it doesn't really help, man. It kind of shows you what to do, but like the yeah. time is still the same. Physically too, some of these, like, I think you have to hold stuff, right? Some of these are like holding pieces together mm -hmm. and then like sliding other stuff around, yeah. right? Okay. So we've got those. Let's jump into this stuff. So we have these, which are the prototypes actually. When uh, when Aaron was making these, these are like the literal original prototypes from each puzzle. Are these made out of the same thing? It's made of the same thing. It's just not got the coloring on it, I think. Yeah. So. Uh, with the coating. Yeah. Yeah, it really smooths it out. Yeah, so this is like the original stuff that like when you're getting them made that Aaron made up. It's a little different, some of them, like this one here. Um, it actually looks like, I don't know, maybe, I don't know if it's a, the, the finish is different, but this one actually looks like it's made of different stuff, maybe a little bit. At least it's kind of shiny on the one side. It'd just be a different cut. Like this yeah. one could be like against the grain kind of thing. And then you notice little things too, like, hey, like the corners here are not rounded. Yeah. And they're, they're rounded here. So there's like some design stuff that kind of came in when we did these. But yeah, this is like the original stuff, uh, the prototype. So that's what we get when, uh, and then we just make sure that they work. Make up some packaging. Yeah. So they come, yeah, again with, let's pull over, so grab the Ooh, brown the one brown there. One. There you go. So this is the, the full thing. Right there. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. 
So, um, I don't know, you have anything? What do you, what do you think? What do you, you said you like the design of the, what was that one again? This is the big A yeah, cross. I that one was cool. I think it's really neat. Yeah. Pretty well, it's okay. So Aaron manufactured these? Like he's yeah, he, he's part of, he has like some technical abilities to like make these and, and uh, type of water. Is he doing it with like water cutter or a laser cutter? No, I don't think it's water. I'm actually not 100% sure. That's one thing I'd like to do is actually go and video Aaron making some of this stuff. Oh, that would be cool. And like right? see the process. I think it'd be yeah, really yeah, neat. Yeah. But maybe we'll try to get a video of that and see if we can cut it into this. Eh? Yeah. He does have a water jet that like they, they have a water jet where he said he was filming one. So like with the water jet, I think it was the water jet. Cause so it shoots out like high pressure water and apparently there's like a little shock wave it sends out when it does that and so Aaron had his phone there and it literally cracked the lens of his camera Gee, the shock okay. wave from it when he did it wow. yeah I don't know if these are cut with water I think these ones might not be I think this so it's like a CNC machine that like yeah cuts it out I don't know how it does it but Aaron will explain that because he is doing solutions and reviews no he's doing solutions for all this you're shooting reviews. reviews yeah, so I yeah. learn about these things. So by the time you guys are watching this video, the review and the solutions should be yeah. at least out or close to out. So uh, yeah, keep an eye out for those. And they will be available on the Puzzle Master website, puzzlemaster.ca. We're not giving away these, or not selling these, but we need to do a giveaway of one of our prototypes. I don't know if that'll ever happen. No, I don't. I, mean, I bet you this yeah. goes into the collection. Into the Puzzle Master vault? Collection. The Puzzle Master collection is a stack of boxes upstairs here. <laughs> it's a big stack it's of boxes, lot. man. There, it's a lot. There is puzzles from like over the decades yeah. and stuff, and lots of stuff that wasn't commercially available. We'd love to like get into that stuff yeah. and check it out, but. Uh, yeah, you can't do a lot of it on camera though, because some of it's not being produced, so that they have patent issues with a lot of it. Yeah. But there was one time I went into a room here and there's just boxes or like just suitcases stacked on top of each other. And it's from these those international puzzle parties since the yeah. 80s, man. Yeah, Al like buys a suitcase, puts puzzles in it, and just like, stacks the suitcase here. Yeah, it just That's keeps crazy. them. So yeah, a little bit of Puzzle Master history there for you some of the new stuff so this is i like the line do you like the color like the the fact that these are all kind of like the same colors i like those like the same colors this would make it so much harder man because at least this you have a reference to like which pieces which ones uh, they're all black. i never even thought about that you don't like yeah. all the pieces start to look the same you yeah know? exactly even like explaining this in like a solution would be difficult yeah so if you had mm -hmm. them all as different colors you could at least track where the piece is going but it won't be just black right it will come in other ones right there's the yeah. silver there um it'll come in like the gold and black and brown all kind of yeah yeah so cool that is this um we're not going to do aaron's anomalies i think we took a little bit of extra time with this stuff so we want to shorten up the episode a little bit. We're going to cut out Aaron's anomalies and uh, jump into some other stuff. Okay, let's get into the online buzz. The online buzz. There we go. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> online buzz. Okay. You know, remember last week, I think I talked about um, a movie. There's that like puzzle movie. Oh, the, puzzle movie. the girl yeah, I yeah, got yeah. into jigsaws. Yeah. But another puzzle movie. Actually, yeah. I, was, I was downstairs and one of the guys referenced it. Um, uh, my dad actually leon uh he said there's a puzzle uh, like a speed cuber movie on uh netflix a speed cubing speed movie. cubing so it's not actually a movie it's like a documentary it's called the speed cubers it's on netflix uh, it's about two dudes um Mar max park and felix oh boy oh, you Zem zemdegs yeah yeah felix Zem zemdegs i think and it's these two guys who are like top of the the pile for speed cubing. I think they hold records, like they hold a bunch of records and stuff, but they're friends, younger dudes. Uh, Max Park actually has autism, which I thought was pretty cool. So like the whole movie is like about their friendship, but also like, I think a bit about Max and like overcoming or succeeding despite like what could be viewed as a disability, right? With the autism. So that's pretty cool. And it's a documentary on Netflix. I thought that was pretty neat. Speed cubers. Yeah. Yeah, I watched. I watched the preview. Um, looks good, actually. I like literally. I would. I would go watch that. It looked. Looked. Looked good. Um, yeah. So that's that movie. Uh, the lock picking lawyer is another one. I don't. Know if we've, have we talked about uh, him before on here? 
No, that's a great name. He's Better good. than the Metagribologist. Yeah. He has 2.5 million subscribers on, on YouTube, so he's big time. Big time. But uh, yeah, does lots of lock picking. He's really just, just pretty standard, but he, he's, he's engaging, man. I like what he does. And uh, he shows you how to pick locks and talks about lots of different locks. Hasn't gotten into puzzles a whole lot, but he did get into one thanks to Mr. Puzzle. So apparently Mr. Puzzle connected with him, sent him the Titan... Titan lock? Titan, I think it's called that. He calls it- Is that the, like one of those T locks? Like, no, 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 it's called, he calls it Titan's treasure, which I don't think that's the actual name. I think it's called the Titan lock. We're working at getting it here at Puzzle Master. We don't have it, but it's like a brass body. And then there's like little, um, uh, like hex keys that are hex bolts that come out. Okay. Like three of them. Yeah. So it's, it's a, like a real lock. So Titan is like, it's an actual lock. But then the guy who does the puzzle has like modified it. Mm -hmm. And so that's why the lock picking lawyer did it because he's used to locks. He knows this lock apparently fairly well. And so he thought it'd be interesting to like get into a uh, puzzle version of it that someone created. Cool. Yeah, Mr. Puzzle sent it to him. Mr. Puzzle even sent him like a little page. So it was neat. The guy has really cool stuff. I'd actually take some time, watch his channel, man. It, like I, I think I could get into lock picking. Oh be, yeah, for sure. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. For not, not for criminal or nefarious purposes either. Oh, well, so, we'll see. You know, the odd time, maybe if you wanted to like have some fun, <laughs> it might be an interesting skill to pick up, but yeah. So that's the lock picking lawyer. Check him out. He does really good stuff. Um, and is way bigger than us. So Ooh. yeah. Another one puzzle leisure. We've talked about him before or this, this it's a Facebook page. Group, Facebook page, mm -hmm. not group, Facebook page by Stefan Baumiger. So Stefan's done like Excalibur, Merlin, Thor's Hammer, Thor's Hammer, some of that stuff. So uh, puzzle, puzzle Leisure. Now, so the way he does it is puzzle and then leisure, but the L and the E from puzzle and yep. leisure are used kind of both. So it puzzle leisure, puzzle leisure, however you want to say it. But he has a new puzzle, Stefan does, called Spheres. Really cool actually. It's a wooden box and he's got lots of cool design on the box. And then inside there's like these wooden like L shapes and then three balls and all three balls are different sizes. Mm -hmm. And I think the balls are actually made out of stone or something or oh, like cool. rock of some kind. And they're, it looks really neat and you have to pack them into the box and then close the lid. Yeah, uh, there's a, a review or two of it I read and it's really neat. I think they look cool. Uh, but Stefan always has interesting stuff, man. The guy does some great puzzles. So yeah. check him out, Puzzle Leisure on Puzzle Facebook. Leisure. And that led me, Puzzle. one of the guys who did a review of Spheres, which I thought was a really cool puzzle and a great review was on PuzzlePusher.com. I don't know who that is. But they had some really great reviews. I actually saw a puzzle on puzzlepusher.com I'd never seen before. And uh, I sent it to uh, the guys here and said, hey, we need to get this puzzle. So yeah, puzzlepusher.com. It's just, it's no, no videos, nothing. It's just like written reviews. And the guy kind of walks you through as he solves stuff. So I think that was pretty neat. He likes, he's like, I'm 15 minutes in, I've done this and this. Here's what I'm thinking. And then like the next paragraph's like, oh, I'm 45 minutes in and here's what I'm done. Uh, here's kind of the way it's changed. And he kind of walks you through, which I thought was a neat, neat way of doing it. Walks you through the solution and writes it down. Cool. So, that's good, puzzlepusher.com. But that's all I got for you, online buzz, so. Oh yeah. Yeah. Twitter, Twitter. Facebook, YouTube. TikTok. TikTok. Did Click that the... get outlawed in the States? Did it? Is that actually a thing? I've heard I of that. Know. I thought they shut it down or sure. something. We're in Canada though, so. Yeah. TikTok. <laughs> Yeah. So, um, that everything? yeah, that's everything. I think okay, that's all I cool. got. Thank like, you guys for subscribe. watching. Subscribe. Yeah. Let's do Get it. our emails on the website, yeah. puzzlemaster.com. Yeah, we got puzzlemaster.ca. Puzzlemaster.ca. <laughs> yeah, too much. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. Go uh, check out episode 42 for to win a hat. To win a hat? Yeah. Comment in the thing which hat you like. Make sure you do that. Thank you guys for watching. See ya.